We've got the Los Angeles Lakers and the Los Angeles Clippers. You're in for a treat as we bring you NBA basketball on 2K Sports. And our broadcast team tonight, Greg Anthony here to my left and Steve Smith to my right. And the Hall of Famer, David Aldridge, along the sideline. And Smitty, we know when it comes to the Clippers, they seem to go as Kawhi Leonard goes. No doubt, Kevin. The only year they didn't make the playoffs with him, he was hurt. But when he's healthy, they are dangerous. Smart and so unselfish. Excellent find by LeBron. Pass to man. Nobody near George. It's good from long range. And that's exactly what he's looking for. Draining the triple. And about a minute gone here in the first quarter. Now LeBron defended by George. Nasty move. And James throws it down. How about that one from LeBron James? That was nice. And out of bounds as the Lakers gain possession. You want unselfishness, but you also need to keep it under control. Here's the Lakers with the ball. Pass to Vanderbilt. Here's Reeves. Back to Vanderbilt. Six on the shot clock. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. And a nice job here early of establishing an inside presence. Out to the right wing. Outside Leonard. Back to George. Some nice ball movement by the Clippers. Drains it from beyond the arm. I like to see Kawhi looking for his teammates, keeping the offense flowing. And here's Russell. Loads it up for Davis. It's deflected. Paul George with the steal. For the finish. And the jam by Harden. And the defense to start that play was terrific. I love the fact that they attacked early in the shot clock. Really uh, the right play defensively. If you can't block, force them to the line. Lakers shooting their first free throws of the game on this trip to the line. Steve, wouldn't you agree the Los Angeles Lakers are one of, if not the most storied franchise in the NBA? Yes, Kevin, the facts prove it. The number one and number two all-time league scorers both captured the record as Lakers. That's history right there. Zubats is an experienced vet, someone who's adept at knowing what to do in screen and rolls. And so George will bring it up for the Los Angeles Clippers. Three-point lead. Picked away. A solo fast break. All going up court. For the three. Reeves can't hit. Clippers leading by three. Makes it out to Leonard. Here's Zubats. Here he goes. That's good, and it's Leonard with the assist. Zubats has got his second basket of the game. I love the concentration by Zubats. He was sure of his decision right there. Davis. And finished off by Davis. One of the cases where height fails to tell you the whole story. Outside Leonard. Here's Mann. And he jams it with authority. Not the kind of aggressive defense they need to cut into the lead. Yeah, you have to protect the rim, Greg, a little better. Also, if you can't get stops at this point, it really doesn't matter what you do at the offensive end. Here's Leonard after the basket by the Lakers. Here's Mann. He's got five. Harden surveying the D. Inside. No good from Zubats. 
He is so good attacking the rim. It's rare to see him denied like that. LeBron's shot is good. Scoring well from the interior. LeBron making it look effortless. And Harden with the stuff. A little artistry in the painted area converting against the size. Proving once again that when you attack with confidence, good things tend to happen. Yeah, not sure what that was about. I mean, talk about a brain cramp. And the Lakers making a change here. Now LeBron. Down low. Pass to Davis. It's hauled in by Zubats. Hmm, I'm not sure what happened on that play. May have relaxed a little bit once he got to the rim. I'm shocked that didn't turn into three points. I mean, he makes you pay on those nearly every time. Clippers leading by three. Powell, no one around him. And the three off target. So it's the Lakers now. James. LeBron. Got it. And he's now three for five from the field. The veracity of LeBron on display. Just tearing through the lane with ease. Kicks it out to Leonard. Nice fake, but the layup off the mark. Here's a chance for them to retake the lead. And they have done well to stick around these last few minutes. James, no good. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. And you know, we always talk about this. Just changing the shot can be just as effective as blocking it, even though it's less spectacular. And a large portion of Harden's shots come from the perimeter. And for good reason. He is an absolute sharpshooter. Now here's James. Six points for him. They set the pick. Pass to Reeves. And out of bounds as the Clippers gain possession. The Lakers making a switch here. Clippers leading by four. Harden right side. Here's Mann. Good. It's Harden with the assist that time. Mann's got a couple of threes now in the first for the Clippers. Oh, great find there from Harden. He's just so good at finding his teammates in rhythm. Davis with it. And it's Harden picking him up. Trying to answer back. But that three is off the mark. And Clippers with the ball. And Jared Vanderbilt gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul. Pass to man. It's stolen. Here's Reeves. Throws down the breakaway jam. And that's how you do it, guys. Ball pressure and then get some run out. Left side, Westbrook. Out to the wing. Tice, no one around him. And the Clippers miss again. And you don't want to give up that kind of look too often. Davis. And it's slammed in by Davis. Watch out and watch your head when AD goes up. And for his size and Steve, when healthy, Anthony Davis is as agile and mobile as they come. That's his secret sauce, Kevin. He has great size and skill, but his ability to move like a guard really separates him from other bigs. Greg, looking at the history of the Lakers, they always feel they're a title contender. And they've been to the finals in every decade. Their longest championship drought in L.A., just 12 years. So, to me, the best franchise in NBA history. Steve, this current Clippers group, they're changing the identity of this franchise. Hey, Kevin, you know this. For a long time, they couldn't get right. Winning just one playoff series during their first 27 seasons in L.A. Now the Clippers expect to make postseason runs. 
load management, a term, Greg, that's been associated with the Clippers. And Kawhi rightfully managing his return from ACL injury with care. It's harder to build chemistry when guys are out, but it's all about staying healthy for the postseason. In Westbrook, here we go. Fires for three. Christian Wood grabs the rebound. Lakers trail by three. And oh, he blocked it and deflects off the backboard. It's Powell on the wing. Pass to Tucker. Out of bounds. The Lakers will take possession. Misread each other on the pass. Tried to recover, but too late. And so it's Hachimura who brings up the ball for the Los Angeles Lakers. Here's Reeves. Got a piece of it. And they'll get another chance. Pass to Vincent. Six to shoot. Davis sets a screen. Loads it up for Davis. And it's slammed in by Davis. You see the weight that 80s added to his frame over the years. Now invites contact. The Lakers moving the ball around. Back to Vincent. Davis inside. He's got nine. That doesn't go in. Had a chance, though, to take the lead. The Clippers in the lead. Here's Powell. It's tipped. And now, here's Davis, the fast break opportunity. Sinks that one from the post. And that's 11 points for Davis. I tell you what, it's, it's almost like stealing to watch how he plays the game from this seat. Here's George. And here's Westbrook from the arc. One quarter in the books, and it's been a close one so far. Lakers ahead. As they end the first quarter on a 9-1 to one run. And back in a moment as we'll get underway with... And some good action in the books as we get back to the game that's been pretty close here so far. And let's take a moment here to get your guys' take on scoring so far for the Lakers. It's all about pace for me. They have set the tone in that area, and they are playing fast, flying up the floor and putting all kinds of pressure on the defense. Pass to Vincent. Back to Wood. The Lakers need to get a shot off here. A putback. It's good on the putback. Hayes has got the lead up to three now for the Lakers. And you know we talk about it all the time, guys. A second chance bucket is always the result of that extra effort. Well, we know this, many for the Lakers. As long as they have LeBron James, they're in a win-now mode, don't you think? Yes, Kevin, and why not? LeBron is still playing at an incredible level, and the Lakers are a franchise that only cares about titles. Wood sets a screen. Pass to Hayes. He's looking for LeBron and finds it. And the shot is good. LeBron's got eight points. And we always talk about making your teammate better. That assist was right on target. George with the ball. And D'Angelo Russell picks up the foul. That is his first foul of the game. Personal foul. Second team foul. Shot from the inbound. Indeed, George drops it in. Five points in the game. Wow, the vision of P.J. Tucker made that play possible. James fires from way outside. Off target with his three. The Clippers trail. To the paint. Here's Westbrook. Got him with the bump fake, but couldn't finish. James outside. The offensive rebound. 
to Reddish. Fires the three. Tips it up. James on the follow. And the Lakers lead by three. Heads up play on the glass. LeBron getting to perfect position for the putback. Tice. And Tice throws it down. Oh, just solid on the one-handed slam. And guys, when it's a tight ball game like this, he's the guy they want with the ball. And the latest now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Hey there, Kevin. Kawhi Leonard continuing to work his way back to peak form after his ACL terror during the 2021 playoffs. He said, I missed a whole year of basketball. I don't want to take anything for granted. I'm just trying to live in the moment and bring a sense of energy for the team. I'm still young, I'm a lot stronger, and I'm back. So, I'm happy. Kevin? Yeah, good to see, D.A. Hey, thank you. That's off as well. So he misses both. You know, Steve, you have to respect a guy like Norman Powell who embraces his role on this team. I definitely do, Kevin. Norman Powell isn't chasing the spotlight. He's working to support his team and really embraces his role on the floor. Here's LeBron. I love the way George can move his feet and challenge the shot without foul. Pass to Tucker. And stolen by James. Over in the corner, Reddish. The Lakers moving the ball around. Unhindered, going all the way. And George with the stuff. We've seen the lead change hands quite a bit in this one. And guys, I think each team knows they can win this game. Just a matter who can catch that momentum. To the middle. Here's LeBron. LeBron. James gets inside and finishes. LeBron is playing well. The ageless Clippers wonder. And the Clippers decide to take their first time out here. it out to Leonard. Pass to Zubats. And stolen by LeBron. The rebound by Harden. And so it's Harden bringing it up for the Los Angeles Clippers. Here's Mann. He makes another one. That's four up and four in to start his game. Nice feed. Leonard with good timing. Good ball placement. And that one's good. Russell. Guys, what a wild first half this has been. <laughs> a while back in fourth start, that's for sure. Kicks it out to Leonard. Out to the right wing. Coffee. His three-pointers off the mark. The Lakers in the lead. To the wing right side. Outside, Russell. Back to Reddish. Shot clock at six. And it's Russell missing. And here are the Clippers now. It's stolen by Reddish. LeBron outside. They set the pick. LeBron gathering speed. And another field goal in his total. Make it 7 for 14, shooting 50%. Outside Leonard. Pass to Zubat. Harden outside. And again, no good by the Clippers. Rare you'll see him miss such an open look. That's a stomach punch, guys. Mm. Turn it over and give him a free run to the bucket. Oh, you're so right. No question who has the momentum now. But the truth is, those type of plays are going to happen. You just have to regroup mentally and get back to work. Puts one up from 19. Harden, no good. Missing that one helps out all the analytical guys from the mid-range. James wide open. 
Reddish. Nice persistence mm -hmm. to chip it back up and in. When inspired, Reddish is a good rebounder. Great physical tools at 6'7 with a 7'1 wingspan. Kicks it out to Harden. Pass to Mann. Back to Harden. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. It's going to be on Cam Reddish. And the Clippers, one of the more efficient three-point shooting teams, Greg, in the NBA. And Kevin, really, over the last decade, that's been one of their most consistent traits. And it's not just because of talent. They're smart about the shots they take. And, Greg, we still see players embellishing contact. Is enough being done to discourage those creative flourishes? We're talking about flopping, right? I mean, we're seeing the league experiment assessing a technical free throw. It's necessary or guys will keep jerking their heads and falling down, and, and who wants to see that? Clippers trail by three. Outside Leonard. Back to Harden. And it's out of bounds. The Clippers able to retain possession here. And he jumped out to that ball immediately. Great reaction on that deflection. A little bit late there, but you tried to get into your opponent's head. Forced them to go somewhere else with the ball, and he did that. And the wide-open shot from Reddish controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Oh, how about the deft touch? right there guys he just guided that ball back up and in just a fingertip touch on the ball kicks it out to Harden back to Leonard in the corner it's Plumley, and the basket is good Plumley's got his first basket attacking the defense with the pass don't need to be a hero Davis looking for an opening. Screen by Russell. To the inside. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. Two minutes remaining. Pass to Plumley. Now here's Harden. Launches it. And Davis pulls it down. Last break. The Lakers. And here is Vanderbilt. Davis with it. He's guarded by Plumley. And it's slammed in by Davis. Just so fast. I mean, it's like trying to stop a train when he's coming in for the slam. Pass to man. Harden outside. Gets it to drop, and now he's shooting at a five for eight clip. An offensive juggernaut. It's fun watching Harden go out and just take over. Screen by Russell. And the call on the shot sends him to the line. We know Greg L.A.'s challenge recently has been finding the right supporting cast for their star. And they're looking for that perfect fit. And sometimes that's all it takes, you know. It's finding those perfect one or two other guys to get you there. It's about health. When AD is, he's a major force. A nightly double-double threat with incredible length and athleticism. Shoots from 12. Man with the rebound. Clippers trail by four. Plumley with the screen. Pass to Coffey. Here is Plumley. He's guarded by Davis. Kicks it out to Harden. Down low. On the wing, Harden. Goes back up. And Davis sends it back. Putting that seven foot six wingspan to use. AD continues to climb the all time blocks list. Gotta run the clock and wait for the last shot. Yes, you do, but it's a dilemma. If you get a great look earlier in the clock, do you take it? No, I tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. 
the Clippers have gone five of eight from the charity stripe here tonight. And what's remarkable is how complete Harden's game is. Making shots or making passes, he can create points in a number of ways. Here's Hayes. And a close game so far through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. Lakers lead by two. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. Keep it right here on 2K Sports. We've got second half action for you, and if the next couple quarters are similar to the first, this one could go down to the last possession. Here's Mann. Pass to Harden. And there's the three-second call, this one on the defense. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the game here. And I know he was pleased with his foul shooting last year. How about 87% from the line? And he shows the focus there, nails the technical. You know, when you have a guy like Kawhi Leonard, so much of what you do goes through him. You trust him. You trust his abilities. It can be a little disheartening when you do everything right and come away with nothing. Back to LeBron. Hayes trying to break through. James, no good. The Clippers trail. Here's Harden. No luck that time in the shot that would have put them on top. Here's Vanderbilt. And the dunk by Vanderbilt. This guy is a high flyer. I mean, especially for a power forward, and he needs to be as an undersized player. And the Clippers call time here. As the teams head into this timeout, a chance for the coaches now to map out some plays for the next few minutes and a chance for the players to rehydrate with some Gatorade. That's important if they want to make sure they don't wear down later in the game. Absolutely. Over the course of a game, you have to stay hydrated. To the wing on the left. Here's Tucker. That doesn't go on the chance to tie. Lakers leading by three. Here's LeBron. That one no good. George with the defensive effort. Powell and it's blocked and it's out of bounds the Clippers able to retain possession here now here is George and contact on the shot so he'll be shooting free throws here first personal foul injuries have hampered Paul George over the last few years but when he's healthy he's elite Greg, he's still a go-to option offensively who can guard the league's top wings. And as he's aged, he's really embraced a leadership role. Looking to get it going. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Smitty will remember this date, February 8, 2023, a very special night. LeBron passing Kareem Abdul-Jabbar on the all-time scoring list. Kevin, that record is a testament to LeBron's will. He takes incredible care of his body. At 20 years in, LeBron James still playing at a high level. And so the ball is out of bounds. Vanderbilt touched it last. Just over a minute and a half had passed here in the third quarter. Some nice ball movement by the Clippers. And again, it's the Clippers missing. And when you can't get anything to fall, it definitely gets in your head. And his rhythm, it's been way off. The goal now might be to get him something easy at the rim so he can just see the ball go in through the net, and that helps. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. Jump ball. Here's Reeves. Shoots over Tucker. And they force the shot clock violation. Great team. And those are the kinds of mistakes that are magnified when we're talking about a game down the stretch. 
Smart anchor at passes, Greg, are really paying off for them at the moment. And also good off-ball movement. Everyone is paying attention and looking to create the best shot for the team. It's time now to hear from our Hall of Fame reporter, David Aldridge. What's the latest, David? Thank you, Kevin. Well, the Clippers have their sights set high. Coach Deron Lu says this is definitely a championship team, but it's not going to just come. We've got to put the work in. There's got to be a lot of sacrifices. If we come together and do the right things, we definitely have a chance. Kevin, back to you. And David, he's a big reason why. Thanks so much. Such a wide open look. Westbrook's got himself going with the triple, his first basket of the game. Be careful when Westbrook is knocking down goals consistently. Watch out, because that means there's nothing he can't do. And they take the lead. George has got 12 points in the game. A great competitive game so far. And from the look of it, this one could go right down to the wire. And here is Powell. Still yet to score. Back to George. And it's the Lakers on the break. Here's James. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. And Tice throws it down. Love what Paul George is doing right there, spotting those wide open guys. Here's James. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. And talking about LeBron James, Steve, he still is on the hunt for more championships. Kevin, that hunger is still evident. He's all about finishing his career on a strong note, which includes winning as many titles as possible. LeBron James has always been a team-first guy. He will score, rebound it, and pass it. Powell, that's good. Their ability, again, to stretch the floor, particularly in this second half. This was obviously a focal point coming out of the break. Look smart when the shots are going down. They didn't have much of a problem getting the ball into the post that time. Six attempts for him at the line. He's made four. 77% shooter at the line a season ago. Those are better than the average number. The kick out to Westbrook. Now Powell. Pass to Tice. Five to shoot. The Clippers need to get off a shot. Or three, Westbrook. Lakers trail by three. To the middle. Got a piece of it. It's stolen by Tice. Outside for George. And the rejection by James. Over LeBron. No, no, no. Going to have to try something different next time. Out to Russell. For the tie. Kept alive. Davis on the follow. And those second chance points really become almost like bonus points when you can get them. In the corner, George with it. Back to Tice. Three-pointer. The rebound by James. Yeah, but the defenders draped all over him. He just could not shake loose. An intentional foul committed, but for what purpose, Greg? I'm not sure. A, a, a scene of confusion right there. I can't imagine why he thought it was a good idea to foul there. And they now lead as the free throw drops for him. George with the ball. And Hachimura picks him up defensively. A nice shot by George. For a number of seasons, Russell Westbrook has averaged double-digit assists. Powell pulls it in. Yeah, you, you won't see him miss many dunks unless you've got somebody right in his face, as was the case there on that possession. George with the ball. He's got 14. Four on the clock. Pass to Tucker. Back to George. 
A 19-foot shot. And they'll turn it over. Could not get off a shot. 24-second violation. And so it's Hachimura who brings up the ball for the Lakers. Inside. Davis up top. He's got 18. Nice ball movement here by the Lakers. Russell left side. The putback. It's hauled in by the Clippers. Here's Tice. He's got six. In the corner, Powell with it. It's stolen by Reddish. Hachimura with it. George picks him up. Back to Hachimura. Misses the three. Okay, that's frustrating. You work hard to get these open looks. You know he liked that one back. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for the Clippers. Smart ball handling from them in this one. Passing around to get ahead of the defense and putting it in the hands of ready shooters. Here is Russell. Beyond the arc. Rebounded by Tucker. You know, we talk a lot about scoring efficiency. He's displaying the exact opposite. Pass to Tice. It's George on the wing. He's got 14. Fires the three. It's hauled in by Wood. And they had some botched coverage that turned into no coverage. His offensive bag goes very deep. AD is so effective on that end. It's stolen by Davis. The second effort drops in the layup for two. Davis has got 22. And look at how the hustle game has been going for the Lakers. Their defense, it's their defense. It has been downright incredible so far being disruptive and coming up with steals left and right. Lock at six. Outside, George gets it to go from beyond the arc. George has got ten points in the quarter. PG-13 showing shades of his younger self with that quick shot. Russell looking around to the paint. Davis can't get it to go. The Clippers in the lead. Pass to Tice. Puts up a three. Christian Wood grabs the rebound. And it's the Lakers ball. To the left wing. Now, here's Reddish. The shot, no good. A for effort, but when there's that much resistance at the rim, you better find another option. Go into the rack with energy, and the D afraid to cut him off. Yeah, gotta chalk that one up to some shaky defending. In a close game like this, everything has to be challenged, and everything has to be earned. Westbrook with it. He's picked up by Russell. Pass to Powell. Hits the three-point bomb. Powell's got eight points. You see why Powell is so valuable. Good athlete, good defender, and can really space the floor. Davis. And it's Davis with the jam. Beautiful location on the pass, as usual. Led his man perfectly. Now, here's Tucker. On the wing, George. Tucker is green. Goes up on the high post. It's stolen by Davis. Pass to Russell. Top of the key, Hachimura. Back to Russell. Down low. One second left. It's still anybody's game as we reach the end of three. The Clippers on top, up by three. And fourth quarter basketball will be coming your way on 2K Sports right after this.
And with three quarters behind us, we start the fourth quarter in what is still anybody's ballgame. Lakers trail by three. James looking it over. It's good. LeBron James. LeBron's got 23. And that pick takes the D totally out of the equation. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Pass to Zubac. Man. Second chance shot. It's blocked. Here's Reeves. And trying for the go-ahead basket. It doesn't go in. From D. Martin. Oh, through the foul. And almost hit the three-point bucket. But he'll go to the line to shoot three. It's just so difficult to guard the beard without fouling. Hart is constantly seeking out contact. And he can't make it three for three. From deep three-point land. Just five to shoot. Just couldn't take the lid off. They had their chances, but came up empty. Here's LeBron. Merciless inside. Merciless James. Power and persistence. LeBron refusing to be knocked around. To take the lead. It's hauled in by the Clippers. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. That's on LeBron James. Defensive. Creative at finding ways to draw fouls. Leonard takes pleasure in getting them to overcompensate. Out of bounds, the Clippers take possession. Clippers, Clippers leading by four. Harden up top, over to the wing. To the right side. And the officials calling for a three second violation. Lakers trail by four. Here's Reeves. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Oh, the officials are all over that. And the first one at the line is good. And the Clippers making a change here. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. And what an advantage. You really feel like you can always trust him when he's at the line. Pass to man. Off target from three-point range. And so James will bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers to tie it up. LeBron, oh, LeBron finishes inside with authority. The defense hanging all over LeBron James. He takes the opportunity and he scores. Here's Leonard. Here's Mann. Just five on the clock. Pass to Coffee. Not three off the mark. Uncontested look. Can't fault the shot selection. He's money from there. A shot by LeBron. No good. Clippers with the ball. Outside Leonard. Here's Harden. Driving to the basket. Oh, and James Harden throws it down home. This is how a floor leader makes a statement. Harden just put the other team on notice. No good on the free throw. And he's taking care of the hard part tonight, which is getting to the line. But, but he hasn't finished the job once he gets there. Good on the second free throw. Plenty of drama in this one so far. Yeah, don't be surprised if it isn't decided until the final buzzer. It's out of bounds. The Clippers able to retain possession here. And the Lakers call time here. Well, it's a player's lead, but certainly coaching has its place. 
Yeah, if that weren't the case, you wouldn't see so many coaching changes in the offseason. While we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David? Hey, was able to listen in on Darvin Ham and his team. Coach was really hyping up his guys. He told them, this is what it's all about, fellas. You're in this spot for a reason. Go out and take this win. See if they can follow those instructions, guys. Okay, David, thanks. To take the lead. Plumley with the rebound. It's Powell with the drive. Count it. Look at the intensity on that drive. Norman Powell charging in like no one can stop him. Pass to Reeves. And it's slammed in by Davis. Oh, going high to throw that one down. Sky high. Fantastic one-hand jam. Westbrook feeling it out a bit. Tucker a screen. The kick out to Westbrook. Pass to Coffey. Takes the three. And it's Anthony Davis with the rebound. The Lakers trail. And the foul is called. He intentionally grabbed him there for some reason. I don't know. Kevin, Kevin, all I can think of is that he's trying to slow the game down a little bit. And right. That's a stretch, though. Definitely a strange move on his part. So for the Clippers. Substitution on the floor. Outside, Davis. They set the pick. Pass to Reeves to take the lead. Sinks it. What range from outside. Wow. And the Lakers lead by two. And guys, here in the fourth quarter, still a close game. Instant classic, fellas. This one could come right down to the last shot. Hachimura, no good. Outside Leonard. Pass to man. Over to the left wing. And again, no good by the Clippers. Here's Reeves. Davis up top. Crosses over. Makes a fantastic move and nails the shot. And it's a four-point Laker lead. I mean, it's amazing to watch AD at his size dance with the rock and create space for his shot. Pass to Vanderbilt. Outside, Davis. And it's Hachi Murray in the corner. And that one falls coming off of Davis's feed. Hachi Murray's got the lead up to six now for the Lakers. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Harden gets the bucket. And what control from Harden inside, adjusting his shot perfectly for that short-range make. Pass to Davis. Back to Vincent. Launches a three, and the three ball is good. Vincent's got his first three points of the game. Nice pass from A.D. Wanting to set up his open teammate. And the dunk by Zubox. Huge points from Zubox. His size helping him in these big possessions. Inside, Davis. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. George, no good on the free throw. In my opinion, one of the most talented two-way players of this generation. Paul George has stayed humble throughout his success and has shown that he is willing to do whatever it takes 
to win. And that one is good from Zubac. And, and guys, all about hard work from this point on. They, they've worked hard to create that high-quality shot and then able to knock it down. Pass to Reeves. Davis sets a screen. Loads it up for Davis. Stolen by Harden. And here's George. Six on the shot clock. Here's Mann. Over in the corner, Zubac. And he overshot that one, missing. Pass to Reeves. Davis sets a screen. Here's Reeves. Oh, and there's the alley -oop. And they force the shot clock violation. Great team. Clippers trail by three. And here's Harden. That's the Zubox. And Davis sends it back. There's a minute 34 left to play here in the fourth. Right wing. To the middle. Stolen by George. Harden. Out to the right wing. Cuts off the pass. Here's Reeves to the inside. Left side Davis. And it's Davis finishing it off. Boy, I tell you, AD has always been clutch. George with the ball. Pass to Leonard. Got it! What a beautiful shot to bring him to within three. The crucial points. Kawhi stepping up to the plate when his team needs him the most. And this is who LeBron James is. An incredible leader. When the game is tight, this guy willing to step up. George looking over the floor. Green by Zubac. Six to shoot. It's stolen by Davis. Loads it up for Davis. And it's slammed in by Davis. We're in total command of this game with time starting to run out. Reason why they've tightened up the vice grip a little more each time up the floor. We'll see if they can close this one out.